Hello again, YouTube. Pauline Koki here with another YouTube video. That's right, Polly. And today, we're finally doing more I Hope So video reactions. Yay! Yeah, I know, right? I mean, it's been so long since we've done these video reactions, but now we're doing a video reaction of episode 5 and 6. Oh yeah, baby! Bring on the popcorn! Um... Polly, we don't have popcorn. What? Alright, here we go, here we go. Let's see what we got. The Tale of Storm on the Horizon. Oh, I see. It's one of those stories that a clever likes to talk about before the episode starts. Oh, God, rest her soul. Half blind with hunger, he followed the wind until the storm cleared, revealing a beautiful oasis with plenty of water and bounty. Plenty of water and bounty? Ooh, that's pretty good. Important traveler bylaws. A wrong turn may take you to the right place. Uh, wait a minute. How does a wrong turn take you to the right place? I don't know, Koki, but look, the video is starting. Ooh, I like the background. My father gave Jasper one request. Wait a minute, what? My future queen in the grove. Uh oh. Yikes, future queen? Uh oh, he if must be talking about adamant. Oh no, this can't be good. Send the word, or else. Oh man, this is bad. This is so bad. Koki, what are we gonna do? I don't know. No. Now I gotta run across the entire plains and spend my whole life asking around. Great. No, I've. Seen oh man, this can't be good. Nuh-uh. Sorry, sir. I need your eyes on the lookout. Hello! <laughs> you too, little oh, guy. Oh, no! No! No, Lion Cub! I'm no! So that white fun. lion is a bad guy! Please keep your mouth keep shut! Yeah, keep it shut! The reward will be great. We will watch out for you. Ah, uh, yeah. I so doubt so that so he's lying. I'll bet There's there no isn't any baseball. reward at all. Bright and radiant are all like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and just so you know, I hope so belongs to Detective Calico. So let's give a big shout out to Detective Calico. <sighs> oh, look, Koki, it's Diamond. Oh, hi there, Diamond. Soon. How's it going? <laughs> Just for that, we're staying an extra hour. Treasonists. <laughs> <laughs> I think traitors is less of a mouthful. <laughs> oh, did you hear? Ron's reported that Zircon nearly fell down a mine shaft again. Fuzzbrain. You think? Oh, oh no, did she say a mine shaft? Going down oh, tunnels. yeah, I think so, Polly. You can never. Be too I'll careful with those things. Needs to stop being so reckless. <laughs> Good luck. He's determined to prove himself and become your knight. He can prove himself by listening to me for once. Besides, oh no, Koki, look, look it's the white lion again. Oh no, go away, please. True. I remember hearing about that guy who tried to take a chunk out of your grandpa. Jasper? Whoa, wait a minute, what? They're talking about Jasper? Oh my god, they are! Oh man, I can't believe it! Yeah, I can't believe it either! Oh boy, this can't be good. Let's see what the white lion wants. Yeah, but I don't think it's gonna be pretty! Oh boy, here we go! State your name and business. I am Fade, squire to my father, King Edge. I wish to speak oh, with the ruler uh, of the mountains. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, well, it's nice to meet you, Fade. Not! Sorry, but I've never heard of this King Edge, buddy. 
And that's a bad look when a king has no reputation. Where have you oh, been? yeah! You I tell him, Diamond! A yeah! To Way to speak up! Area? Now, are you going to actually do your job and fetch your king? Or do I report to my father that the Thundering Mountains is filled with nothing but empty-headed grunts? Oh, oh, oh no, he did it! Yeah, oh no, he did it! Oh, somebody needs to slap Fate Silly! Or I will do my job. We're looking for three runaway lionesses. Uh, your Highness. And you're just some do-gooder looking out for their well-being. Right? You know the law forbids you from pursuing a fleeing enemy. So even if we knew where they were, we wouldn't tell you anyway. I beg you oh yeah, consider. there's no way we're gonna My tell! Yeah, no that's right, Polly. Our lips are sealed. Okay, and besides, uh, our mouths I never move you. while we talk. But because we're plushies. How dare you say that to my face! You asked for it! <laughs> oh yeah! Look at him run, that big fat coward! Yeah, somebody should cast him in the Wizard of Oz because he is nothing but a cowardly oh, lion. <laughs> to my kingdom and make demands, he can go eat his own mane. Oh, you're all on the next shift. Guess what? Diamond nearly clawed the face off of some snobby squire. A squire? And it was Oh yeah! <laughs> That's yeah. right! <laughs> Diamond sure said him hair. running! <laughs> he was trying to get news on some travelers and was really rude. Diamond told him to scram, and he was all, How dare you! Say that to my face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That's what Polly and I did. We had a good laugh after Diamond Chase fade away. <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty good one. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, that is so cute. I like it when the lions lend some uh, helping hands. Yeah, I do too. Can't catch me. Oh, how cute lion cubs playing. Oh, how cute. Oh, I'm so sorry they disturbed you, your highness. It's all right, Pearl. They're not bothering me at all. <laughs> okay, just keep it down, cubs. Take that! <laughs> <laughs> if I may, your highness, you should try and get as much peace as you can. Being a sentry takes a lot of your time. I know you mean well, Bronze, but I insist my subjects go about their lives while I relax. Especially the cubs. I meant no offense, your highness, but don't feel obligated to tolerate the youths if they get too... Overbearing. I'm Wait a minute, what? Now. Overbearing? Like hanging out with you all. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> I forget that sometimes. <sighs> I hope I made myself clear to that squire. Oh yeah, I hope so too, but I have a feeling that we haven't seen the last of him. Yeah, I have a feeling we're gonna see Fate again real soon! Part about being a king is being controlling Oh, there he is now! Oh boy, looks like he's gonna try to make a plan or something. Yeah, I think so too! Uh, okay, what now? I don't know! Storm is coming, and Hope is in the middle of it. Oh no! Where's Storm? And Animus? I don't know. Oh my God! This kind of reminds me of Nothing and Azra during Nothing's Dream in My Pride Episode Six. Yeah, I think so. But whoa, what's going on now? I don't know. Who's that? I don't know. Clever! Clever! You're okay! Oh god! Oh, she's alive! She's she's alive! She's alive! 
Oh, what a touching reunion! Oh, clever. You wouldn't believe what we've been through. What? Hey, where are you going? Yeah, where are you going? Come back here! Then don't you want to see Hope again? Oh, come on, she's crying! Yeah, come on! Oh, come on! I mean, you're alive, and that's what matters! Come on! Please come back! Yeah, come back! Come back! Oh, no! Was it all just a dream? Oh, I'm afraid so. Aw, oh, man, I was hoping that Clever would be alive. Yeah, I hope so, too. What a ripoff. What a ripoff. I don't think I can take down a Thunderfoot. Hey, wait a minute. Uh, what's a Thunderfoot? I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, I think they're talking about those elephants. Oh, right, because they have big feet. Oh, I'm sorry. Still getting used to this. Hey, no worries. Did you sleep all right? Yeah, I think so. Even though someone is a sloppy sleeper. So, guys, I don't want to complain, but where are we going? We're going to meet up with my ma and my brother Wynn. Okay, great. Where oh, I oh, wait, see. So, uh, it's going to be like a, a family a reunion for a storm. Okay, then. There's a place called Echo Lake. We just have to follow the stars. Which ones tell you where the lake is? Uh, those. Right there. We call it the Queen Saga. Leads us straight there. And the stars all lead to different places? Amazing! How do you remember them all? You figure it out after a while. Well, I'm well. glad that and lions are great navigators, right. but and I can never be days, good at really navigation with stars. I can only count on a GPS. Yeah, me too, Let's buddy! Go ahead. I'm gonna get us some scurriers as a snack. You What's a scurrier? I think she's talking about those meerkats. Oh, okay. Sounds of my stomach roaring. All right, learn it the hard way. Hey, Storm. Oh, oh yeah. I see those meerkats. Yeah. Okay, I see now. Lion in the storm. Do you have any idea what it means? It sounds like you're seeing the traveler to me. There's quite a few stories where she appears in a storm, ending jobs caused by the Great King. I've always found it kind of cool. Oh, the Traveler. I think you I remember her know. now. She's like the Grim Reaper, right? Mystery. Yeah, I think so. I think I know what that means. Yeah. I miss her. I felt like maybe I'll never move on. But also, am I a bad person if I do? Oh, not. no, I no, 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 Hope. You're not a bad person. I mean, I remember how you stood up to your mother, your father, because they were so mean to you, and you bravely left home. Yeah, you're not a terrible person. You're not hopeless. You're hopeful. And that's okay. Thank you, Storm. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much, Storm. I mean, thank you so much. Even though with that, we kind of talked over oh, you. Yeah, it. sorry about I that. No. Bad hunting. And what did we learn about hunting scurriers? They're not worth it. Oh, I guess so. Uh, Adamant didn't oh, catch those meerkats. Oops. Uh, I mean, no, scurriers. <laughs> haven't eaten anything decent in days. Actually, I think I've found something we can hunt. Tall horns? Oh, goody! Supper time for the lions! Mmm, yum, 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 yum. Yummy, 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 yummy! Bite the butt, but don't get stabbed. Hope you'll do the rest. Brilliant. Thanks. We got this. Oh, yeah, you got this, girls. You can do it. Yeah, you can do it. We believe in you. And they're off. Check it out. 
she'll get trampled for sure. Oh no, I hear Vicious's voice in my head. Yeah, me too. Oh, I'm not listening. La 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 la. We're not listening. La 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 la. Yeah, you got him. Hooray! I'll say, you're amazing. Oh yeah. You wanna go back for the scariest? Give a round of applause to Hope! Yeah, good job, Hope. Uh, We're so proud of you. Oh, now what? I don't know! Hmm. Hmm. Oh my god, look! A baby hyena! Oops! <laughs> uh, sorry about that, viewers at home. I mean, uh, uh, a baby cackler. Uh, Hope, you know that's a cackler, right? Oh, that yes. poor I mean, baby cackler. I wonder where he came back. from. I don't know, huh. but he is cute. I think he's separated from his pride. He looks like he hasn't eaten in days. I think we can look after him. I mean, we're all travelers out here, and that includes cackler cubs. Oh, but yeah. God, here, here, Storm. So here, here. Let's look We're after this baby hyena. Oh, uh, I fine. mean to say a cackler. I mean to just leave him alone. So, did you catch his name? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't. I don't speak cackler. We should call him Storm Jr. Because he has a little Storm Jr.? Oh, how cute! How adorable! I'll bet he's gonna be like the mascot for the trio. Yeah, I hope so. That'll be so cool! <laughs> She's not wrong. And also, like me, he's hungry. Uh, what's the matter? Aren't you hungry? Yeah, it's just... In prides, the king normally eats first. That's... that's silly. I'm a king, but not like... Sorry, it's just what I've been taught. Force of habit. It's all right, Adamant. Go ahead, girls! Eat up! Yeah! Right, bon appetit! Oh, yeah. uh, you it's too, Storm Jr. You must be very hungry. That is how you lose a toe, Storm. <laughs> it's cute that he's so tiny and yet he thinks he's a big scary cackler already. Oh man, I just love Storm Jr. already. Look how he eats! Yeah, it's so cute! In a carnivorous way! Oh, what a cute little baby! Oh, coochie, 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 coo! Coochie, 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 coo! Oh, careful, Koki! You might bite your hand off! Oh, come on! It's just a video! It's nice taking care of a cub. Maybe we can take him with us. Get real. He's too little to walk that far. And we can't stay here in the middle of nowhere. He needs his pride. Oh, no! We can't abandon no, Storm Jr. He's so cute! Yeah, yeah just look at him! Cacklers. I know he doesn't speak lion, but no traveler ever passes up the chance to hear a good story. And you'll never pass up the chance to tell one. <laughs> Oh, goody, I think it's anyway, story time. Yay, I love story it's time! The of the graceful wind. Long ago, there was a traveler known as Graceful Wind. Her pride had died from a mysterious illness, leaving her the sole survivor. Wait a minute, what? A mysterious graceful illness? Oh, God. She missed her and she's the sole survivor? How sad! Oh, how sad! She missed the of somebody to cuddle up with during the long cold nights. One night, after finding a quiet place to rest, Graceful Wynn awoke to find that she was not alone. A pride of cacklers still Oh, alive. a band of cacklers? Not really good! ...to kill her, being a lone lioness. Hold on, Storm. I know Junior can't understand us, but it's pretty rude to tell a story where the cacklers are the bad guys. Do you want to tell the story? No? Then let me tell it. Okay, besides... <laughs> okay, Junior that was pretty funny! <laughs> the way how Adamant interrupted the story okay. like that? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Wynn got away from the cacklers and spent the remainder of the morning looking for some food. Forced to admit defeat, she settled down to sleep as dawn approached. Over the next few days, Graceful Wind tried and failed to catch her own food. And every evening... Aw oh, man, this Graceful Wind character is having some bad luck in this story. Yeah, I 
hope there's a happy ending! After the fourth day of no success, Graceful Wind finally admitted defeat. She finally ate the meat that the cacklers left. Oh, I see. So the hyenas, oops, I mean, the cacklers gave the meat to the lion. Oh, okay. I think I see now. For the first time in days, Graceful Wind had a successful hunt. It appeared the traveler had graced her for her efforts. She left the meat for the wary cacklers who helped her. Eventually, Graceful Wind met another traveler with some cubs, and they both raised them together, teaching them and their grandchildren and so on to always leave some meat for the cacklers that saved their ancestor's life. Oh, what a touching story! I've always hoped that there would be a happy ending! Yeah, I really love that story! Oh, how cute! All of our hearts beat the same. The same blood runs through our veins. All creatures live beneath the traveler's light. And nobody should ever cast them out of it. That... That was so beautiful! Oh! I'm so happy it makes me want to cry. What a beautiful bedtime story. There was just a mutual respect, but it went a long way. I guess I was listening to Dad too much. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, Adamant. Your father was so dead wrong. Yeah, we don't like him. That must make you right all the time. More right than you and your little hair tuff, anyway. <laughs> Guys, please. Anyway, I think it's a good idea for you and the best name. Oh yeah, you girls should get some sleep, but uh, we're not done with our video reactions just yet. No, we're not! Sleep well, Junior. Um, okay. We're done with episode 5. Now we're gonna get ready for episode 6. I said before, and I'll say it again. Give a big shout out to Detective Calico. Oh, look at that. Isn't that adorable with Storm Jr.? It's kind of like reading a photo album. Oh, I love Storm Jr. He's so cute. Did you want to talk about yesterday? Oh, uh, what's going on? I you don't know. know. Weird, being a traveler and then having a couple pride lions traveling with you. I just don't see prides like you do, Storm. I don't see having one as a bad thing. Sorry. But I don't see why anyone should have to swear fealty to a monarch. Especially when the rules were- Oh, I see. They're talking about prides. Okay. Um... So, Storm doesn't want a pride, and she prefers to be a traveler. Okay, I see what's going on here. Yeah, I do too! That isn't what I meant. I, I meant we're like a family. The three of us. We'll look out for each other, always. We're a family. Yeah, that's right, Hope. Sure. And even though that we're just crazy. watching a video right yeah, now, right. we'll look after you girls too! I mean, yeah! Amen to that, brother! Clever treated us like family. If she had still been queen, things would have been different. That's the way things are with prides. Your happiness depends on whether the one in charge likes you. No traveler has to worry about that. Ever. We don't have to worry about anything. Aside from being alone, unappreciated, having no home to call your own because you get driven out. Oh, poor Hope! I feel bad for her! Yeah, that's right, Polly. I feel bad for her, too. I mean, the way how her own parents treat her bad, it's... It was just wrong. Yeah, I know. It was horrible. He's tired. Oh, let's not talk about Jasper and Vicious. Let's let Storm Jr. sleep. Oh, what a cute baby. 
What were you two arguing about? We weren't arguing, it was just a discussion. Okay. What were you discussing in a very loud and intense way? Uh, what's going on? I don't know! Ah! Storm Jr., come back here! Yeah, stay with the lionesses! No, don't go off on your Storm own! Jr. Yeah, come back here! That little jerk! Storm Jr., where are you? Are you? Yeah, so Ollie, 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 Oxen Free! Oh, he's to your left. Oh no! Looks like Adamant is blasting uh, off again! <laughs> a good Pokemon running gag! Oh! Storm Junior, baby! Oh, thank goodness we found you! Oh, our precious little baby! Oh my god! Is that? It's. It's Storm Junior's mother! Uh. Hi! Uh, 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 when we said that it's our precious little baby, uh, uh, we were only kidding! Yeah, yeah! Oh, it's your baby, not ours! It's uh, your baby! No, no, Mommy! These three lionesses are my friends! Please don't hurt them! They're the ones who saved my life, Mommy! Please, you have to believe me! Wow! Can you really translate hyenas? Oh, I mean, uh, cacklers? Uh, no, I was just uh, making it up as I go along. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you so much for saving my baby. At first, I thought that you kidnapped him. But now I realize <laughs> you <laughs> saved my son's <laughs> life. Thank you. Come on, Storm Jr. Come on, it's time to go home. Okay, Mommy. <laughs> okay, Koki, you can cut it out now. Okay, I'm sorry. I just can't resist. That's just so funny. I know, he can't understand me. I think he gets the idea. Oh, goodbye, Storm, Storm Jr. I hope we'll see you again someday. Yeah, maybe when you grow up. Oh, we're good. It's yep. our baby boy! Oh, We're goodbye! Awesome. Goodbye! Oh, Luckily, goodbye! Oh, oh. Time, I was kind of hoping that he would be like a mascot, just like Pikachu from Pokemon. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, sad! Um, that was our path to the other side. Yeah. Uh-oh, looks Maybe like they uh, came upon an I obstacle. Don't oh, boy. This can't Maybe be good. None of us are making a climb that steep. It's too risky. We could cause another rock slide. I'm so sorry. I meant for us to be there by now. Hey, this isn't your fault. There has to be more than one way to get there. <laughs> I don't see what's so funny, Adamant. Huh? Uh, that wasn't me. Trees. I don't know, but we better keep a sharp uh, eye out. Laughing tree? Ah, a oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Take cactus. it easy, Polly. Take it easy. It's just a cub. Oh, uh, sorry. Oh, way to go. You gave us away. Mom's gonna be mad at you. Good thing their mom was nearby. I'd hate to babysit these two. Be nice. Maybe they know about a different path to take. And maybe the Great King themselves will come down and declare me their knight. Were you trying to climb those rocks? That's pretty fuzz brained. We saw them fall. Okay, they're kind of cool. cute, but uh, I think they need to learn about so manners. Yeah! Where are your What's parents? the manners, you two? It's just Mom and us. She's out hunting. Why? I was wondering if she'd known any other way to the lake on the other side of the mountains. Probably. Mom knows everything. Your mom sounds nice. What does she call you, little ones? She's always saying we're a burden. 
So I'm a, a burden. Oh no! Is the mother gonna be like vicious? Oh no! Please no! Yeah. We don't want another I vicious, and that? I hope so. Burden means you're a pain, a hindrance. It's a horrible name. Don't you have real names? We don't really get names until we're grown-ups. If we ever want to have one. I don't see the point in having a name. Maybe not you, but I don't want to be stuck with a burden if it means I'm a pain. But you are a pain! Oh yeah? Wow. And I thought our mother was harsh. Yeah, I she know, right? Your mother harsh. was the worst. I mean, forget line. Power Strike. I, I want to slap her, name. silly. So their mom doesn't really bother with names. Who's a pain now? Oh, I wouldn't be surprised these two have been abandoned already. Poor Scraps. I'm still here, actually. So you can go elsewhere and find oh, other scraps. Dad, there's the real mother. And she has a dead monkey. Must be my relative. Hey, uh, don't look at me, madam. Uh, uh, I don't taste pretty good. And besides, I I fart constantly. I mean, uh, take this, for example. It's enough to oh, oh god, no, it's Koki! That's all we do a video reaction! Oh, I'm sorry, Polly. But if that leopard tries to eat me, she will be sick for a week. There a burden? Call it whatever you wish. This time next year, they won't be my problem. They're going to grow up hating you if you don't treat them better. <laughs> I'm not going to lose sleep over whether they hate me or not. I'll know when they leave, they won't be as hopeless as you. What did she just say? Uh, Come on, helpful. Uh, She's just that right makes me so mad! I'd say it's been a pleasure. But it hasn't. Good luck raising your... burdens. <sighs> Look. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're darn right you should be sorry, because if you ever say that she's hopeless again, I will slap you silly. I don't care that I'm a boy. Follow the base of the mountain westward. You'll see the entrance to a canyon. You can't miss it. Why the sudden change of heart? Because I want you to leave my territory and never come back. The longer you stay here, the more prey you'll have to eat. Besides tall necks, there's not much as it is. How do we know you're even telling the truth? Yeah, we don't trust don't you! We don't trust you at all, you jerk! Yeah, get up in that tree! Come on, she's right. We don't really have anything else to go on. It's better than sitting here doing nothing. Maybe I'll get my bearings. Trust that leopard. Yeah, me too. I sure hope that those two cubs will grow up soon and leave her. Yeah, me too. I don't trust that leopard, mother. I'm aware. Okay, everybody. That was the video reactions to I Hope So, episode 5 and 6. Yeah, that's right, Polly. And let's give a big shout out to Detective Calico and the other YouTube channel called A Volta. Yeah, let's give a big round of applause. Yay! Oh, man, I love A Volta! Detective Calico! Yeah, me too, buddy. Me too. Oh, uh, anyway, check out the link in the description down below to check them out. And we'll see you all next time. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Adios. Au revoir. Auf Wiedersehen. And all kinds of goodbye stuff. Goodbye. Goodbye.